The fallout continues for the Oklahoma University fraternity, whose members were recorded chanting racial slurs in videos over the weekend. School officials have expelled two students and say more could follow. Rachel Scher has the latest developments. Rachel? Yeah, good evening, Morris. You know, in the last half hour, we've learned the two students who were expelled for their role in this video have come forward. The family of one of those students released a statement saying in part, we would like to apologize to the entire African-American community, University of Oklahoma student body, and administration. But these apologies come as new questions begin to surface. While U-Haul trucks idle outside the SAE fraternity house, storm clouds hang overhead. And as they pack their bags, I hope they think long and hard about what they've done. The president of the University of Oklahoma has shut down the Sigma Alpha Epsilon house and calls members a disgrace after this video surfaced of them singing a racist chant with lyrics referring to lynching. William James II became a member 14 years ago. It's a brotherhood he now disowns. I don't know what happened to the culture of my home, but that is not my home. That is not SAE, and that is, they are not my brothers. The national president of the fraternity is also condemning the video and threatening to suspend those involved for life. But members in other states say this chant is part of a national tradition that remains secret until now. This chant wasn't something they learned overnight. It was something that was well known, well versed, that everybody on that bus felt privileged to say and to proudly clap at. And as for the university, its investigation continues trying to identify other students pictured in that video. The school's president says there could be even more expulsions in the coming days. Live in the newsroom, Rachel Scher, News Channel 8.